Everyone loves chocolate, but not everyone knows where it comes from. The story of chocolate formation from a tree to a chocolate bar is full of science, flavor, and art. Making chocolate step by step. Coca cultivation. This process starts with coca tree. Each tree bears oval fruit which are about 5 to 12 inches long. Each fruit contain 30 to 50 seeds and these seeds are called coca beans. Harvesting. When fruits turns yellow, it means that they are ready to harvest. They can be harvested continuously throughout the year. After harvesting, pods are open and seeds are removed. Each seed is about the size of olive. In Latin America, the pulp in which seeds are present were used to make coca wine 3000 years ago. Cleaning. Beans or seeds are cleaned by hands. Then they are exposed to light. The cream-colored seeds turn a purplish color. then they are ready for fermentation next step is fermentation during fermentation process beans are heaped in piles on ground and in latin america a system of cascading boxes are used in both methods beans are covered with banana leaves during 2 to 9 days of fermentation beans will get the color and same flavor like a chocolate next step is drying and shipping Fermented beans are carefully dried by placing them on wooden boards or bamboo mats for 7 to 14 days under hot sun. Once dried, they are packed into sacks and bundles and shipped and traded to international market or directly exported to chocolate market. Preparing coca mass. Beans are cleaned then roasted at low temperature to develop flavor shells are separated from nibs by the process called winnowing then they are finally ground into coca mass which is solid at room temperature then it is placed under extremely high pressure and the paste gives two products coca powder and coca butter next step is producing chocolate Coca mass, cocoa butter and some sugar are mixed, grind and kneaded into a paste to make chocolate. Dark chocolate required only cocoa mass, cocoa butter and sugar, while white chocolate needs only cocoa butter, sugar and powdered milk with no cocoa mass. Next is conching. It is a careful process of rolling, heating, and aeration into a large agitator that stir and smooths the mixture under heat. Here some lecithin and coca butter is added for required fluidity. It is a very important step. The longer is the conching process, the smoother it will be the chocolate. The final step is tempering and molding. The chocolate is now finished and ready for final processing during which it is put into a blocks of drops. This method requires tempering where chocolate is slowly brought to a certain temperature to give it stable, shiny and smooth surface and then it is transferred to chocolater for packing process. This is how the yummy chocolate come into being. Stay healthy, stay aware. Remember me in your prayers.